everyone, welcome to my review of the Ultra Saber Sentinel V4. These three have the Obsidian V4 soundboard. This one is just a stunt saber. This one is in red. This one is in orange with window emitters, which is an additional option. And as you can see, these three also have the AV switch. This one has the standard latching switch, which comes basic. <clears throat> this one is Adigan Silver with a yellow um, color disc. And then my Sentinel V4 in Arctic Blue. I didn't go in with anything in fancy um, pommels. And I also opted out of having a uh, CoverTech wheel on these. Um, but yeah, these are overall a pretty good uh, basic saber. Um, not bad if it's your very first saber that you get from Ultra Sabers. Um, it is also a little bit longer than say the Apprentice Saber, but does look very similar to their V4. I do like the look of their V5s just a little bit more. I do wish I had one. Um, but yeah, I'd also recommend getting the Obsidian V4 soundboard. It's an extra $10 if you're gonna go with sound. And uh, it has a lot more options. I think it comes with five or six sound fonts, including uh, the mute option. The V3 does not have that option. It is just one um, sound font at any given time. <clears throat> um, window emitters is up to you if you choose to go with that. Um, I would also highly recommend paying the extra money for the AV switch. It is a lot nicer. These switches are prone to breaking because they're just plastic whereas these ones are made out of metal. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this review. I hope to see you in the next video. Have a good day.